Yo, what is going on, you guys? Welcome to another video where today we are back to more Roblox, and today we will be showing you how to get your very own free huge pet in Pet Simulator X. This is not a joke, this is not an April Fool's joke or anything. This is 100% real, and it's gonna take some hard work, but you guys can do it, and I'll show you how. So, we got my restaurant right here, and they had an update recently. Um, literally uh okay not today but it was yesterday they had an update yesterday uh the alien update but something else came along with this update that was the chance to get a free huge pet for pet simulator x so i got right to it well i did not get right to it i uh hey cool santa already sweet i did not get right to it i did not hear about this until today so i've never played my restaurant before like I know it's the same it's by the same creators of Pet Simulator X but I've never played it before so I thought I'd give it a try um, today because I want a huge pet obviously who wouldn't and you know I've honestly um, since I'm a newer player there's not much I can do to like get as a lot of customers because that's what you're gonna need is a lot of customers but honestly Right now I have 8,100, so that's 8,100, and I guess you can say 28. Two Santa, okay, that's weird by the way, getting two Santas at once, let's make sure he gets a seat. Look at that, two Santas, is that rare? We gotta get a picture of that, hold on, give me that screenshot. Two Santas, that's crazy. But anyways, let me turn the sound down. Anyways, so, um, I started playing today, and I'm already racking up 8,000 customers and uh, I was uh, I also met up with a few people a few of my friends and they said that was pretty good like they're kind of shocked a little bit um, I don't know if it's good for you guys but they said it's pretty good for me playing only for today um, I'll be showing you guys how to do it too so you can't see it right now so let me move my face cam right over here but now you can see on the bottom left you need 100,000 customers served in order to get the huge pet and the huge pet is called the huge chef cat nice leveled up let's go the uh pet is called the huge chef cat and he's pretty cool just like a normal huge pet you know but he looks like a chef pretty cool uh the only thing i don't know is when this uh it's for a limited time by the way so I don't know when this is gonna be gone. So make sure you guys get on this straight ahead. But right now we're gonna show you how to the best technique that I have found that will get you customers really quickly. Let's go. All right, so I've done this twice. Uh, first time, I, my first floor really sucked. By the way, Santa, dude, Santa's so OP. I'm not even gonna lie. Like he drops presents that are can get up to a thousand dollars each, and for me. That's pretty good, because as I said, I'm a newer player, and Santa has honestly given me a lot of money. I'll take money for Christmas. Um, so right here, right now, I have four floors, and remember, this is all from today. So, floor two, exactly the same. You know, we got some L's, we got some... It might be a little laggy, that's okay. Um, so, what is going on? Okay. So I'm so I just got floor three. Well, floor four I have for the uh, wishing well. Which by this wishing well, by the way, guys, it's a definitely investment. It's a good investment. Um, it costs like seventy-seven thousand, I believe. But it's a lot of money. I know it's pricey. But if you get Santa, then he will like he'll spawn more often. Obviously, if you get him, then he'll drop a bunch of presents, and you can't afford this. And this well gives you like. It'll give you boost. It'll give you money. I only got it one time, and I got five thousand from it, which was honestly pretty good. Uh, every five hours, it will give you something, so it's pretty good. So we're gonna go ahead for three, and I will show you guys the exact layout to get a lot of customers fast. So just straight away, we're gonna st start. So go to your shop, scroll down to tables. You want you want to get the tiki table, which is two hundred. This stuff might be a little pricey, especially if you're new, uh, but eventually, eventually you will um, have enough. 
so yeah a little pricey I know but um, for now it's what you're gonna have to do so get the tiki table you want to buy a lot of these and I have 77 is that say th I don't know if that says 37 or 77 okay it said 37 which will not be enough but um what you want to do take your tiki tables and what you want to do is you want to place them along this whole entire floor so this could be for your for your second floor your first floor your third floor um i have it for all three uh you don't want to spend too much money on floors though you want to just mainly base it around one floor if you can but a couple floors also does help so what you want to do is you want to skip this first row entirely like this whole entire first row up against the wall you want to skip then on the second row you want to place all of them across the line just like this and since I am not the best player at this game like like I said I literally started today so I will be kind of you know you guys can actually kind of um, be a little easier for you guys to do this like straight away I was looking up some videos before and they were like oh you gotta get this like uh, you gotta get this luxury dishwasher luxury stove you know luxury order stand but I was like I can't afford that so uh, yeah I'm kind of more on everyone else's levels as a new player which is good for you guys so anyways after you do this first row the second row fill the whole entire row up like that after you do that you want to skip two more rows so three four and on the fifth row you want to build another line out like this and basically what we're doing here is we're making room for all the chairs and then you want to do that on exactly this exactly the same thing on the other side so skip the first row one two three four five six seven skip two more rows one two okay there we go and put those all across whoop not like that put those all across just like this and it does get kind of laggy so what you can do for that is you can disable the animations for you can disable the customer notifications the uh that's pretty much it <laughs> to be honest with you that is pretty much it um so yeah, if you turn the animations off that'll help with your lag that'll reduce it a little bit um and now we have all this room what we want what we want to do next is go back to the shop and we want to buy tiki chairs you want to buy a lot of tiki chairs. I don't really know the specific number. Just buy a lot because we're going to need a lot. Um, I'd say around like $10,000 for this layout is pretty good. So I want you guys to try to save up, save up $10,000 and do that. So all we want to do is put chairs across every one of these areas. So just like this. We want to go all the way. So fill them up here, here 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 right there right there wherever you see arrows put those chairs down and done all right and don't you guys worry about covering up this green teleport button because you can literally walk in between the chairs and teleport or you can just go down here and head let me make sure you can see it yeah you can just go down here and uh, head to floors and you can literally just teleport from there um now what you want to do is you want to um, you want to oh whoops forgot to fill in one give me one second Just to fill that in there we go so what you want to do now is you can already tell that customers are gonna start rolling in and doing all that what you want to do is you uh, want to get for my likings you can do however much you want actually but for what I'm gonna do is you want to get let me check my first floor. So I usually get one, two, three, four, five, six stoves and one, two, three dishwashers. And then an order station. So six stoves, three dishwashers. Because there's going to be more cooks than there are dishes to clean. Always. So uh, I do recommend getting the double stove if you can afford it. If not, get the, get the uh, stainless stove. Just get to what you can afford pretty much. But you really want to go for stainless stove and double stove. And then same with sinks, you want to you want to get the dishwasher, but if you can't afford that, then just get the double sink and just work your way up. So we're gonna get 
three dishwashers and six stoves. Three, four, five, six. Very pricey. Very, very pricey. But it's alright. And then we're gonna go ahead and... Oh, nice. I already had a dishwasher. That sucks. Whatever. That's fine. Um, and then we're gonna also get ourselves the order stand. There we are. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our stove. Put your stoves down first because they take up more room. So, like, if you were to put your stove down, like, let's say you put your dishwasher... You put it, the dishwasher only take up one square. So if you put a dishwasher down and try to put a stove in front of it, it won't work because there's that little, the little extra right there. So what you want to do is you, if you put the stove down first and then put a dishwasher over it, it somehow works. So you just want to make it in like a little pile so we can just go like one, two, three, and then wait, wait, I literally just said to use the, the, the my bad. Okay, so we're gonna actually put a stove down like this, okay, and then we're gonna put it down. Doesn't really matter what direction we put it in, to be honest with you, because we're just gonna fill it with dishwashers. Uh, don't trap yourself like I just did. And then we're gonna go ahead and there we go, just like that. So you kind of want it in like this little cube, and don't worry because as you can see, these shell, these chefs and waiters can literally just walk through without even like it won't they can just walk through all this you see they walk through the tables they walk through the chairs they can walk through stoves so don't worry about like making room for them to walk because you're the only one that can't even customers as you can see they're walking through look at that walking through all that so don't even worry about it so just uh you don't even need room to be honest with you and if you want to you can buy um another tiki table and then you can get let's see you can get like four more chairs just like that and then if you put your tiki table right here you can also set your chairs like this and there's some more room which is really good you always need room and then we'll do it again yeah let's just do it again really quick so let's get one two three four set those up and now what you want to do here for this little extra you should have four squares left and then you should have two back here for the two you want to buy let's see where's you want to buy gumball machines because there is a chance that people can walk fast and buy buy a gumball just make sure you put it down before the chairs like I didn't do because it's like the stoves it'll need room but then you can still put chairs down so and then people will just walk past maybe buy a gumball or two uh, They don't really give you much money, but it's 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 kind of nice just to have and then for this room Which I don't have yet, but this area right here um, You want to get yourself a silverware tray Customers have a 20% chance to grab some silverware, which is just eating faster So your customers will eat faster and they will make more room for more customers um that is if you have the silverware trays, which is 200,000 each, so I do not have it yet. But, that's pretty much all you need to know, honestly. Um, as you can see, Santa came in my building, like, um, twice when I joined. So, like, I had, um, you know, I had him once. And then, let's see where we're at. We're at 6,000, or 8,600 and 52 nice okay so um i did play this game a really long time ago like i played it for like five minutes that was before this you know event was going on um so basically um that's really all you need to do like um i recommend uh I recommend you should buy the this like I said buy the well because it's pretty good but I also re recommend buying Santa's cookies you can find them underneath the gadgets never mind you can't you can find them underneath winter Santa's cookies 68,000 but um increases chances that Santa will visit your restaurant and it stacks so the so the chances always increase. What is the shrine? 
Wait, what? I'm so confused. What is the shrine? I'm confused. Huh? That was weird, I guess. I don't really know what the shrine is. Anyways, so this Santa's cookies will stack. So, the more you buy them, the, uh, the more it will, um, increase your chance of Santa's coming. Um, not much more I can think of, to be honest. You can also get, like, um, jewelry case, which is chances of getting a celebrity, uh, which also stacks these stack. Silver play buttons, which is chance to get a YouTuber. Um, that's pretty much it. Like, that's really all you want. But this is the layout you want for your area. Right here. Tables literally everywhere. Because, you know, they're not being filled up too much. But you will get more and more customers as time goes on. The VIP customer. Look at that. Um, and the VIP customers have let's see vip customers serves 10 times more than normal customers which is pretty good uh depends on what they're ordering but let's see if we can find him let's see where this vip is at check our floors i don't see him anywhere what does he look like okay he's really easy to spot he's like dressed in all gold third floor then Oh, there he is, yeah, okay. So, depends on what he's ordering, but this is your VIP. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much all you need to do, and eventually, um, if you, like, leave this for a couple hours, you will get a lot of customers and a lot of money, and you can get more upgrades, try to, you know, save up for those, uh, for the goldens, because... Oh, there's the shrine. It's $10 million. I don't really know what the shrine does. Anyways, um... You want to save up for like the luxury dishwasher, luxury stove, and the golden order stand. Those uh, basically like let you get stuff really fast. So like luxurious, luxurious golden and ins insanely quick cooks at blazing speeds. Thirty five holds thirty five dishes at once and washes it quick, which is really nice. And then this one grants a five percent chance. Food will be delivered with a golden plate, thus being worth three times more. That one's really good. Um, anyways, so yeah, that is it uh, for this video. If you did find this tutorial helpful, um, pretty sure you should get granted like the huge pet like right when you finish it. I'm not sure. I want to keep grinding. I'm going to actually put this on overnight. See how much customers I get then, and then I will have a lot of money as well, and then I will... Uh, you know buy some upgrades and stuff but let me know if you found this video helpful uh leave a like down below subscribe if you're brand new and i'll see you all in the next one goodbye